Hello and welcome to our German Bundt Cake recipe. Bundt Cakes are called Kugelhopf in German and perhaps you heard that word before and you were not aware that Kugelhopf is a German word. Germans have many delicious Kugelhopf recipes, but this recipe has a special ingredient called quark. Quark is a dairy product, like Greek yogurt, but less tart and creamier. This is why quark is the secret ingredient that gives this cake a light and moist texture. But don't worry if you can't find quark in your supermarket. You can make it very easy at home or substitute it for Greek yogurt. Start with greasing and flouring a Kugelhopf or Bundt cake pan. I use my homemade nonstick paste as it's not so messy. The paste is very easy and cheap to make. I will leave the link for the recipe of the cake, like I said, and the recipe for the nonstick paste and some more information about homemade quark in the description below this video. Did you know that during excavations, Kugelhopf pens, just as we know them today, were found, which go back to the Roman times? To make the cake, add flour, baking powder and cornstarch to a bowl and blend everything, then set it aside. Separate the eggs into egg whites and egg yolks. This Quark Gugelhopf is one of my favorite cakes. I'm curious, what is your favorite cake? Let me know in the comments, that would be really interesting to me. Beat the egg whites with a pinch of salt until soft peaks form. Don't beat to stiff peaks, the cake will be not as light as you want it to be. Whisk the butter with the sugar, vanilla sugar and lemon extract until light and creamy. You see, my butter was not soft enough and that is why it took me a little longer. So don't lose your patience, just, just beat the butter and the sugar a little longer and it will be nice and creamy and fluffy. If you don't do this, your cake will be kind of dense. So make sure you really do this. And then add the egg yolks one at a time while you are mixing. You can easily do this in a stand mixer too, so you don't need to hold the whole time the hand mixer in your hand like I do here in this video. Then add the quark to the butter egg mixture and blend it well on medium low. After that, sift the flour mixture on top and mix briefly until just combined. Don't overmix or your cake texture will be too dense and not moist and light like you want it. Now you just need to fold the egg whites into the batter. Some people just pour the batter into the baking pan. You absolutely can do this, but I like to place the batter like this, as I think it's less messy and the cake bakes more evenly. But this is just a personal preference. Bake the 
cake in a preheated oven at 320 degrees Fahrenheit for about 45 to 50 minutes. Allow the cake to cool completely in the baking pan. This way it will remove very easy and you avoid to break it. I like to sprinkle the cake just with powdered sugar, but you could top it with any glaze you like too. Guten Appetit!